Now I've cut that one short before because we want to make sure we can get all these chords nice and clean and some of them may be unfamiliar. So you want to make sure you get those four chords together. After that, this B minor is going to go to a B minor major seven, minor major seven. So what's happening is it's a, there's our B minor. It's minor because of the flat of third in the scale. One, two, three, B, C sharp, or a D flat is what we call it here. And then D. And then we're going to take that B and move it to a B flat. So that's a minor, but it's also one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, major seven of the B. So instead of playing, um, calling it a minor, we're going to call it a minor, major seven. So, bam. And then we have that. We don't need that fourth string there. We can get the five though. So, five. After that, so that's B minor, B minor, and this actually is an F sharp augmented chord, augmented seven. If we play that one, and, two, and that's why it actually works, because what we're really doing is we're pumping that dominant sound, and that's all it is. It's an F sharp augmented seven. So we could call it B minor major seven, which is how most people will read it, or if you want to be theoretically correct in my book. But everybody thinks differently. We can call it an F sharp seven augmented, which means one, two, three, four, five, the raise five. And then, so we've had this resolution going down through the in, two, four. We get that note through this B minor chord because this is a B minor seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I can't talk. That seventh note is a minor seven. This is the major seven. This is the minor seven. So, in, two, and then let's move that down to there. And this will be a nice little voicing of the E seventh. So here's my E. I'm going to mute the fifth string like that. My middle finger will be the fourth string, which is the octave of that. My first finger is the third string, first fret. Pinky at the second string. Third fret and my ring finger at the first string, second fret. So that's the ninth. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. It's so, twelve o'clock. Thank you, Vicky. It's midnight right now. I gotta get going on a second. So when the line starts getting brisk, or when the line starts. Start right from there. I don't have to play the, the six but it sounds nice. So that's our next four chords. B minor, F sharp, augmented, seventh. B minor seventh. E ninth. Or B minor, B minor major seventh, B minor seventh, and E ninth. And then we're gonna go on for our next four.